The East Valley has been home to an amazing place where so many have grown up. Now it's bigger and better than ever, where the fun is unlimited. Hi, I'm Kevin Gray, and get ready for some all day and all night fun as we check out the newly renovated Jake's Unlimited, an entertainment space filled with games, food and drinks, and of course, plenty of family fun. Here's what's coming up on the show. We're going to look back at the history of this family fun center. Plus, we'll also hear about how Jake's is committed to the community. Then we follow along as a multi-million dollar renovation transforms Jake's Unlimited. That and so much more on this special about Jake's Unlimited. Jake's Unlimited has been a fixture in Mesa for more than a decade. And when the old owners were looking to make a change, it was a longtime employee who stepped up to save the neighborhood favorite. Let's take a look at the history of this special place. Hi, my name is Jeremy Hoyam. I am the manager of operations for Jake's Unlimited, and I'm responsible for everything that has to do with the operations in the facility. The concept founders uh, really thought that Arizona was a great place to test the idea that if you put everything uh, that's normally indoors and outdoors in most family entertainment centers uh, all under one roof, because of the heat uh, in the summer of Arizona, they thought that it could be a great success. Hi, I'm Rachel Foreman. I am the Director of Amusement at Jake's Unlimited. So I oversee all of the games, the rides, and the Redemption Store. We opened 12 years ago. Uh, I actually started as a cashier. So I've been with the company for 12 years now. So I was there from before we even opened. So I helped paint like the carousel, the dining rooms, and it was just a really fun environment. We just knew we were gonna put a lot of fun things in a building with a lot of great food, and then we were gonna see what happened from there, and it turned into way more than we thought it was gonna be. The experience that you provide for people is what separates you from everybody else. And so for us, it has been our, our passion, I guess you would say, uh, to ensure that we create an environment where families can have a great time together and create memories that uh, will never be forgotten. And so for, for us to be able to do that and do it on such a high volume of people coming through the doors, uh, it's made us stand out to everybody else that's around. The Family Entertainment Center industry is really fun and exciting to me and it's a different kind of different thing every day when you come into work and you know people want to come there to have fun and so if I can help a family or a date night have a good time and have fun then you know that's that's the reason I'm there and that's why I continue to be there and that's why I'm excited that we're going in the direction that we're going. Well, back in 2005, when Amazing Jake's opened their doors, uh, there was nothing really else like it in the Valley. You know, we're kind of a one-stop shop for everything. We have you know, all the food you can eat, all the rides you can ride, all the games you can play, and that's what made it such a great place to go. In most family entertainment places were completely designed around children. We had a lot of moms come in. They brought their kids in, anywhere from five to 13-year-olds, and they were looking to have a good time. They wanted their kids to have a safe environment to have fun in, and that's definitely something that we provided. In the beginning, we figured out that if we could make sure that the adults could have fun and have quality food, then everybody would stay longer. And now we're almost trying to grow up with those, say, 12-year-olds to Jake's Unlimited. And now we want to give them an option or an opportunity to come back and have fun uh, without their moms. I love to bowl, and there's plenty of places to get your roll on at Jake's. Hey, did you know that bowling was believed to be invented in ancient Egypt thousands of years ago? Here's what's coming up on the show. 
Being a part of the community is important to the folks at Jake's Unlimited. We'll see how they're making a difference for some special kids. And what does it take to renovate an entertainment space like Jake's? We'll follow along as this family favorite gets a major facelift. I love the Midway Games area here at Jake's Unlimited. It's so satisfying winning a souvenir and taking it home. The other thing that makes Jake's so terrific are the employees. Many of them have been here since the beginning. In fact, of those longtime employees, many of them consider Jake's their second family. Yes! <laughs> there it is. Hi, I'm Melissa Shizzle. I'm the Director of Sales for Jake's Unlimited. I handle all the birthday parties, group events, anything sales and marketing related. Funny story, um, I was with Jake's eight years ago and I was with the company for three years. And I left and I've been away for five, so now I'm back. Hi, I'm Chris Sheffy. I'm the Facility Manager at Jake's Unlimited. And basically my job is to fix everything inside the entire facility. So I've definitely gotten the family feeling from Jake's and all the managers actually, even some of the ones that aren't there anymore, they've definitely treated me like family. So I started at Amazing Jake's 12 years ago as a cashier when I was 16. Uh, it was my first job and I just have been with them ever since. Especially the management team, they've all been there almost since day one, especially Jeremy. Uh, he's someone that I really look up to and admire and he's definitely like a mentor for me and so uh, working, he's pretty much the main reason I'm still there, is he, he's just been a great leader, coach, mentor, and really just the people working there is the reason I'm still there. Our very first core value is we treat everybody like family. And um, unfortunately, most companies, uh, they put it up on a banner and put it on the wall and that's where it ends. Um, we don't have it on a banner on the wall, but it's what we live every day. I'm from New York, I'm from Brooklyn, I'm Italian. I Family is huge for me and I need that. You know, I just don't want to work somewhere where you're just going for the paycheck. And Jake's is that place. There's very few people that are as crazy as me to want to stay in this industry forever. That's a first time job for a lot of them. And so uh, to have the ability to, to watch them learn to be a, a great adult, a great young adult, and then chase their dreams. I learn more from them than they learn from me. They don't, they don't even know that. When I'm out on the game floor and people have problems with games, I definitely want to make sure that they're they're happy with their experience for sure because I actually do want them to come back. I've had people that are regulars and it's always good to see them come in. It's, it's kind of a cool connection. We know that where you choose today to go and spend your money that maybe you can't afford to spend is, you know, you want to get what you pay for. So it's really important for us as a team to have people come to Jake's and feel happy and satisfied with the money that they spend, you know, because you don't really get to do that a lot. You know, things are tight. So um, with our staff, I think everyone is just trying to create that experience where you want to come back. And it's like, remember when we were at Jake's and dot, dot, dot. These rides aren't just for kids, but the kids are VIPs here at Jake's Unlimited. Let's check out how they're helping some special kids over at Phoenix Children's Hospital. Woo -hoo -hoo! Hi, my name is Christy Litton. I work with the Phoenix Children's Hospital Foundation. There I am a, an account manager, which means I work with all the great corporate partners that donate to the hospital. 
partnering with Jake's Unlimited on the Hope Celebration, it has been so much fun. Um, kids, families, everyone's are coming down and participating and helping, not only helping the community, but having a really great time and enjoying the wonderful food buffet, uh, games, bowling, you name it. Everyone's having a great time and for a great cause. We have over 60 programs and resources that would not exist without uh, donations and philanthropic support. Our leadership management team had gotten together and we really wanted to give back. We decided on Phoenix Children's Hospital. We're donating 100% of the proceeds to the hospital. Again, it's called um, the first annual Hope Celebration because it goes to their Hope Fund. It's really excited about that because we want to continue to do this every year. Since Jake's has been around for the last 12 years, we probably do every school district has a field trip. Um, so all of the kids in the Valley, probably everywhere in Arizona at some point have been to Jake's. So we really try to help out as much as we can. We donate um, to all you know, school events and just anything that we can do. One of the great things about Jake's Unlimited is that we recently had a job fair and we've hired almost 200 new employees. So we felt that that was also really great for the community bringing these jobs um, in a time when a lot of people are looking for work. Because of this rebranding and renovation that we have you know, invested in, we want local people, especially in Mesa and Gilbert, to utilize our venue. Most people right now will go downtown Phoenix or they'll go out of Mesa because there wasn't really something like us. So now we get to keep it local. So within our restaurant and two brand new bars, we decided as a team also that we wanted to utilize um, all of the local manufacturers for our spirits and beers. Our investors wanted to stay at our location. Being there for 12 years, it was great, but we also, now that we're looking to be a place for everyone, thought, hey, you know, maybe do we need to go somewhere else? And the truth is we didn't, because this is where we want to be. This is where um, people have been coming to us for years. So it's funny now too, because I've had people that have called and said, I had my 12th birthday party there and now I'm 22 and I want to have my birthday. So um, for the community, we want everyone to know that we love Mesa. This is where we want to be and this is where we want to grow. And hopefully when we have our next one, we can say this is where it all started. The bonus room is amazing. Oh. Definitely need that, and I'll take one of those. Definitely gotta have that. Hey, why don't you guys check out what's coming up next on our Jake's Unlimited special, all right? Ooh. A multi-million dollar renovation has turned Jake's Unlimited into an entertainment extravaganza for everyone. See how it started. And the red carpet was rolled out and the place was packed for a very grand reopening. Jake's Unlimited isn't just about games and rides and laser tag, there's plenty of food. So when your little gamers need a break, just head over to the buffet for a real treat. And with two additional bars as part of the multi-million dollar renovation, let's turn this place into something spectacular. My name is Brian Reed. I'm with AR Maze Construction. I'm the Vice President of Pre-Construction. We uh, work with the owners to take the venue from a kids entertainment venue to more of a adult venue.
to uh, compete with the other competition that has recently come into play here. Well, the construction company that we're working with, AR Maze, has been amazing because we've had a lot of changes that we've had to make on the fly. This is a very large project that's compressed in a short amount of time. Uh, so I, I can't speak enough to how great they've been and, and how they've been great partners in communicating every day to make sure that we stay on top of our timelines and because the holiday season is important for us so we have to make sure that we open on time. The owners didn't want to close down the facility at the beginning and so we worked with them to phase the project to be able to work in certain areas and get ahead of the schedule. Because we started while we were still open to the public, we had to plan in zones, you know, and we had to do projects in zones and times and uh, uh, to make it happen within our short period of time. Uh, you'll ask anybody in the industry, this is, this is going to be a miracle when we get this done because of the amount of time that we're doing it in. This takes uh, a lot of effort from the entire team. There's multiple crews. We have a lot of experienced subcontractors out here who specialize in this type of work. And uh, with phasing the project and trying to get everything done in such a compressed schedule, we were required to work multiple shifts, uh, weekends, long hours, et cetera, to pull this off. Well, it's a complete remodel of the whole facility. So flooring, paint, walls, new plumbing. We have new bars, audiovisual, marketing, it, it encompasses everything that we're doing. We have a whole lot of new technology involved in that too, where you don't have to wait in line anymore. So when it's time to bowl, you, you sign up. When it's your turn, we'll send you a text message. You come over and bowl. That way you don't have to stand in line waiting and doing nothing. You can have fun the whole time that you're here. Our company specializes in family entertainment centers. This is one of our biggest niches in, in the business that we do. And uh, we were really excited to be a part of this project and help them create this image and this uh, project that's going to really change the way that Amazing Jake's slash Jake's Unlimited is viewed. We took the old Amazing Jake's brand, which was a great brand and it was respected in the community, uh, but now it's the big brother. You know, it's the new and improved, it's a little bit classier, you know, more friendly towards the adult crowd, but still that base of family friendly environment. Look at that. Jake's Unlimited has been in the East Valley for a while, and to see this transformation take it to the next level has been incredible. All right, get ready for a VIP experience like no other as Jake's Unlimited opens its doors for the first time since the renovation. tired of air hockey and skee-ball and maybe bowling's not your thing, Jake's Unlimited has the perfect solution. Hold on. Check me out. I'm gray, cabin gray, and I've got a date with laser tag. But you can check out the VIP celebration that kicked off Jake's Unlimited grand reopening. This is the first of its kind in the country that is this big and this modern and uh, has this kind of audio visual, has this kind of feel that can cater and be friendly to the family environment. 
and then you can put your kids to bed and come back and have a great time on your own. It's absolutely more adult, it's absolutely more electrifying, more energy. Definitely a place to be, I would say, after 9 or 10 p.m. I'm talking to everybody with strollers and little ones running around. The kids are loving it and having a great time and they don't, they don't feel like it's not a safe environment. Um, but then again, you go and you talk to the people that are here to have some free drinks and uh, they're having an amazing time and they're like, I'm bringing everybody here. And they're telling me this is, there's nothing out here that, that uh, can compare to what we have right here. It has everything. Like, it's a one, one shop stop. I mean, everything is here. Let the kids run around, get them the full day pass and let them go to town. Food, drinks, rides, everything. You know, just seeing our whole vision come, you know, come to life and people enjoying themselves and dancing and having fun. So, it's great. It's exciting. It's it's uplifting. It's just a fun place to be in. Like you don't want to leave. Like once you walk in, you're like, yeah. Like I feel like I'm at home. I just want to yeah, chill, yeah, hang yeah. out with my friends, and have a good time. It took me four years to find investors um, to make this happen, and they they believed in me. Tim and Alan and David, I really appreciate them get, having the faith in my vision uh, to give me the tools that I needed to make this happen. In October, October 15th, we shut down and went hard. You know, it was what I've been, I've been told by multiple people in the industry that you're crazy, there's no way that you can accomplish this, there's no way you should invite a thousand people tonight because you're not gonna get open. I say, watch me do it. And so the only reason that I could do that is because my team is awesome. And every single manager and supervisor and my leads and my, and my employees have been working 12 to 18 hours a day, no days off. They're all committed. And we're committed to this, this experience that we want everybody else to have. And so this family that's here right now is gonna take this place out of here. It's gonna be awesome. Hey, we're finishing up our show at the perfect spot, the bar. You're definitely gonna wanna hang here with friends when Jake's Unlimited turns into Jake's After Dark. I've had such a great time here at Jake's Unlimited, as always, and I know you will too. If you have questions about costs or times, just head to the website, and remember to connect with Jake's Unlimited on Facebook and Instagram. And be sure to tag Jake's Unlimited in all of your photos so everyone can join in on the fun. I hope you enjoyed this special look at the new and improved Jake's Unlimited. Thanks for watching.